Gambler First Nation is a very small community. Less than 100 people live here on the reserve. But the chief and council of this First Nation hope a new partnership, a Manitoba First, leads to big fortunes coming from the ground below. Gambler has partnered with Alcano Exploration, a company that owns oil wells here in oil-rich southwestern Manitoba. The First Nation will own a 40% stake in an oil well that will be drilled on this plot of First Nation-owned land. The ban says there is about 20 years of oil that could add about $20 million. For ban councillor Nathan Tanner, it could mean a new financial outlook. It'll mean um, a little bit of wealth, hopefully a little bit of everything. Uh, Housing is a big issue down here as well, so any, any extra revenues we can generate would be uh, a benefit to uh, all, all those things that we're locking in. The partnership between Gambler and Elcano is a Manitoba first. It comes after the First Nation sued Manitoba oil giant Tundra Oil and Gas. They claim Tundra is taking the oil from underneath the First Nation without compensation. The case is still before the courts and hinges on Gambler proving there is oil beneath the surface. While other First Nations have been granted royalties for oil beneath their land, Gambler is believed to be the first in Manitoba to have a direct say and direct ownership in their own oil well. It's a huge opportunity for Gambler First Nation, first of all. And, um, I mean, the community's been dependent on uh, the government for a long time. The band says it could cost more than half a million dollars to build a well here. They've been able to access federal government funding to foot some of the bill. For Canada's oil and natural gas producers, it's a model that they'd like to see copied. It's a very positive step forward for First Nation communities. Um, It means, first of all, taking control of their own resources and having a say in how those are developed so someone else isn't just coming in and doing it. Tanner hopes Gambler becomes known for its oil. It's always been, um, you know, in that poverty level, so now now that we have something as big as this going on, it's definitely... It's going to put gamblers on on uh, on the map in the way, you know. I don't think anyone has ever imagined. Riley Lechuk, CBC News, Gambler First Nation.